Hey guys, this is Bob. Got the uh, kid all ready for the uh, 48 hour group bills. Uh, Father's Day edition. And uh, the uh, MPC 69 Oldsmobile W30442 uh, Cutlass. My dad had one that was similar. It was actually a more limited edition than the W30. Uh, it was a factory factory only deal that he had gotten um, that had different uh, special colors and uh, uh, had factory red line tires which I'm going to try to find a set of everybody I looked at was out of stock on but uh, yeah let's look at it and uh Here's the box. Picked it up. Picked the kid up off of eBay. Um, so I don't lose the little parts first. Uh, or tail light lenses. Um, front and rear windscreen. I've got four stock tires. And then two drag slicks because this is a two-in-one kit so you can do like a street custom uh, this also kit coming from eBay also had a resin wing from Reese Precision Miniatures I have no idea who that is uh, it came with the kit that's not not going to be using it uh, for the Pro Street version we had a a sheet of decals and Moroso and Goodyear and STP and Hearst and all those good stuff. Not going to be using any of those. Um, Dad's car was a was a real dark charcoal silver, almost black on the sides uh, with the black stripes on the hood. If I remember correctly, it may have been all black on top, but I'm thinking it was just the black stripes. Because I've never seen another one that was a two tone. Um, and I would ask him about it, but he's not doing well right now, and his mind is not all there some days. Um, but I'm going to try to ask him one more time to remember about it, because I know that it got totaled right away after he got it uh, a drunk driver hit him hit him broadside in front of my grandparents tavern and, and just wiped the car out uh, he was lucky to, to not have died during the in the accident because uh, he was waiting waiting to make the turn and uh, I was only like four so I don't remember just what I heard anyway there's our chrome parts, which look pretty decent. And it's a two-in-one version, so I got we got two different sets of wheels. We got the factory wheels, and we got a set of Kragers. Slash American Racing. It's hard to tell at that size. They look like Kragers to me, so we're going to call them Kragers. Uh, chrome intake. We've got a chrome fan, chrome alternator. Uh... Two different sets of chrome valve covers. We've got chrome headers. Um, we have the tri power intake, and you've got chrome air breather for that. Uh, we've got the big four barrel there. <coughs> we've got the Hearst. There's the Hearst console there. Her shifter mirrors are in there and chrome. And those parts look pretty decent. We're probably going to use them as is because I really don't have time to redo them. Um, yep, there goes the hood. Pretty basic chassis all in one for the most part. 
Again, a pretty basic interior bucket. You guys have seen all this stuff before. I dropped the hood on the floor. We'll just leave it there for now. Um, the only seam I see on it is right here at the corner of the hood, or the roof, in the quarter panel. And if I wanted to get snazzy and do a do a vinyl top, that's actually where the top separation line was, so that you could actually do your vinyl top there. Uh, other than that, I'm not seeing any any super bad injector pin marks or seam lines on the body. It looks pretty good. And we got parts, this part's still in the bag. Ready to go, suspension, firewall, you know all you know the drill. No need to go through all that stuff. The decal set for it. Um, well it'll show up in here. You've got a set of the white stripes and a set of the black stripes. And they show up a little bit. Then there's a the custom rod there's different a different set of stripes there plus a different set of hood stripes uh, you know you get your 442 logables there uh, your W30 for the size of the of the car and two different sets of license plates you know standard standard fare standard instruction sheets nothing Nothing earth shattering about those. So we'll be all ready to get started for the uh, 40 48 hour build. Uh, I'm probably going to have to work around it because I have to work all weekend. So I may start it, do, do my two days, my 48 hours before the weekend. If I do that, I will. Hold the postings up until the weekend of the video so that it all syncs up with everybody else. Because that's just the way life is. I very rarely do I have a weekend off. So everybody's getting excited about the group build and it's got their got their model all picked out and be ready to go. So again, I'm doing the uh, 69 Oldsmobile Cutlass W30 version of the 442. It's a Buddha car. So Buddha, 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 Buddha. Have a good one, guys.